，一个大绳子。This is definitely not an easy track, but it's very beautiful. Introduced by the British from Sri Lanka early in the 20th century, and here the climate is very good for tea plantations. Good morning, YouTube. This is Yan. I am on my longest way back home from Europe to China, and right now I am in Cameron Highland in Malaysia. Let me show you my hotel surrounding first. It's surrounded by beautiful green jungles. And speaking of Cameron Highland, it's one of the most popular resort in Malaysia. So started in the 19th century, the British discovered this area and started tea plantations because this area has a very cool climate, unlike the rest part of Malaysia, which is very hot. So afterwards, this place has become very popular. And here, there are three things I want to do. First of all, I want to go for a hike. And discover its mysterious jungles. And secondly, I want to visit their tea plantation to see the tea gardens and drink the local tea. But first of all, I want to go to this. It's called Sempo Temple, which is a Buddhist temple, and it is、um, only three minutes away from my hotel. So the perfect start for the day. This is a very common plant that you can see in Malaysia. It's called Jimson weed. The flower is very big. Look, but be careful. This plant is highly poisonous, so don't touch it. Ah, and this is the avocado tree. 一个人来啊？对，一个人来。嗯，做旅行啊？对。做做主播啊？对。哇，嗯，不简单啊。嗯。这是大车吗？还是轿车？呃，坐公共交通。哇、哦，不简单哎，要很熟悉哎。我大家比我熟。行，那我进去这个店看看。啊啊、谢谢你们。嗯、啊啊。I've just met some Malay Chinese, and you know that most of the Buddhism in Malaysia they are Malay Chinese. Buddhist was actually brought by the Indians first, but then in the 19th century, with the influx of Chinese workers during the British colony,、uh, Chinese Buddhism started to make, play a major role. But also, since Malaysia is a very, it's a country with diverse population, so gradually Buddhism also incorporated the cultures of different regions, such as、um, the Buddhism from Myanmar, from Thailand, etc. The first is Tian Wang Dian, which means Heavenly King for Heavenly Kings.、So、in this, there are four Heavenly Kings who are in charge of four directions: one, two, three, four. They are the protectors of the Buddha. And those four kings, they are also collectively known as Feng Tiao Yu Shen, which means good weather, good climate. Behind the Tian Wang Dian is Da Sheng Bao Dian. It's often the main hall of a Chinese temple, which enshrines Buddha. I'm not a real Buddhist, but it is almost customary for me, or maybe for many Chinese, whenever we visit a temple, we go down our knee, we show respect, and we ask for blessings. Let's have some breakfast first. Okay. 
My breakfast is uh, fried rice noodles with some soya beans and some shrimp. And then I also have a cup of milk tea. <laughs> <笑>我也希望老板多少钱啊一个炒粉一个奶茶九块八人民币十二十三块钱十三块钱人民币对你可以过来呢小姐可以你可以过来拜拜<笑> 好的马来西亚人民币是一个很好的问题我们在问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问他们问
you have to see this this looks like a blanket this moss is so thick I have a new discovery a tropical plant the nepenthes this bag is so big and it's very beautiful look inside there is even a small insect that was trapped by this bag and there is some rainforest Hmm. And there are more. One, two, three. But let me help you to empty the rainbow. Oh, look, there is even one more. I'm sorry, I think I just spoiled your food. Big rope here. I feel like a jungle man. Oh. The moss. So fluffy. Those are the bamboo trees and they are flowering. Bamboo trees don't usually have flowers. They have their flowers only once when they are maybe over 10 years old. And once they are flowering, it means your life is coming to an end. It starts to rain now. That's the weather in the jungle. It's very unpredictable. So I better wear my rain jacket. It starts to rain quite heavily, so... I really have to walk fast and this part is not easy. Look at this. I have to grab the rope to descend very slowly. I really want to walk out of here faster. Why there is no end to it? I keep seeing those yellow signals. But then I go up and down and up and down and I haven't seen the destination. Somehow it felt familiar as if I have been to this place. I hope I am not walking in circles because in a jungle it feels the same everywhere. Oh. Keep going, keep going. Zero point eight kilometer to the most mossy forest and from there I can find some proper road. This hike isn't easy at all, especially during the rainy days. Look at my shoes. This is definitely not an easy track, but it's very beautiful. Look at this beautiful argue.
你好。你叫什么名字？阿当，阿当，阿当。在那边，这边呢？对，这个地方就可以了。可以啊。嗯。啊。阿德，阿德，你看，等会儿，等会儿，先，先。拜拜。拜拜。I've met、um, a Malaysia couple and they gave me a ride and they told me they also speak Chinese Mandarin because they went to a Chinese school so that saves a lot of my time I took a hiking track towards um, through the Baharat tea plantation and I might have just crossed one of the Orang village that is the village of the indigenous people that way? Tea plantation. Thanks. Bye bye. The kid, he pointed me the direction towards the tea plantation. It's quite an interesting village. All the houses, they are lifted because it rains quite often in Malaysia. So it's a kind of a method to protect the house from the rainfall. The hiking path isn't there up, so I'm just walking through the tea gardens. The tea was introduced by the British from Sri Lanka early in the 20th century, and here the climate is very good for tea plantations. For example, in China, normally the tea is only harvested once every year in the spring around April, but here you can harvest the tea almost every month because it has plenty of rainfalls and it's very hot all year round so look at those those are the new tea leaves but when you make tea you only take the tip the small tea leaves to make tea If you take a bite of the tea leaves, it's actually very bitter, just like the tea. And here, you see, those are the ditches because tea trees they don't like a lot of water at the root. So this is for to drain the uh, rainfall. I'm taking a shelter right now and after that piece of clouds moves away, maybe I can fly my drones.
There are many tea plantations in Cameron Highland. One of the most famous ones is called BOH, and there you can even visit their factory to get to know how tea is made. So by the end of the trip, here I am in one of the tea houses. It's very, very popular. So I'm going to have a tea with a beautiful view. Influenced by the British tea culture, the most produced tea in this region has been the black tea and other kinds of fruit tea or flower tea. And in China, we have a very different tea culture. I hope when I go back to China, I can share with you our tea culture. Uh, this is the end of today's video. If you like it, please give me a thumb up. And I've ordered a tea masala together with a scum biscuit. I'm going to enjoy my food now. Thanks for watching and see you next time.